Welcome to another exciting show of transformation. Prosper with Wayne, creating wealth, health, and happiness in your life. With your host, life and business coach, author, entrepreneur, and lover of life, Wayne Sutton. Prepare to become excited, expand your beliefs, and truly prosper in all the areas of your life. Enjoy. Hey guys, Wayne Sutton, Wayne Sutton Life Coach. You pick up your book, lifecoachlifestyle.com. Pick up your book today. I want to talk about starting with the big picture. The big picture must always be very clear before you go into helping people in the smaller details. You want to chunk up before we chunk down for my NLPers out there. So let's talk about this from a place of number one, building a business, and number two, helping your clients. Because I believe, you've heard me say it, everything that we do to build a business is exactly what we're going to do to help clients. If you can master that, and if you can master helping people, you'll help them come into your coaching practice and you'll get paid and you'll also help them change their life, which is transformational on your end and their end. So let's talk about this. Always begin with the big picture because unless you have a picture, literally, and I say, I keep saying picture very uh, very often because you have to have this metaphorical picture they can see. They need to see what happens when they work for you and then when they're working with you, they work with you and then when they're working with you, they need to see what happens as you're working together. What is the outcome? What is the definitive outcome? If you're doing a, a discovery session, a free session, whatever it is, or maybe it's the first session with you, your outcome is to sell the big picture so they can see that they want to work with you. And we talk about selling the dreams and looking at the criteria. Uh, we're going to get into elicitation of values and so forth in the course. We're not going to do it here on the podcast. But we're going to teach you how to do that. In that, we want to bring them on uh, on board into your coaching program. But then you want to use the same big picture, metaphorical imagery to grab a hold of them and to drive them forward to accomplish their goals and their dreams. So, are you beginning your your discovery sessions? Are you beginning your coaching programs, your coaching sessions with a big picture? Let me give you an example. One of the companies that I've uh, that I work with and helping, it's about a, it's a lead generation. Let's just leave it at this: a lead generation system for a professional uh, group of people. And so this lead, it's a lead generation, lead nurturing, coaching. And so what happens is these 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 um, these leads, people in this industry are looking for leads. They need people to talk to. They're in a 100% commission business and 99% of the time, and unless they have leads that they can convert into sales, they do not make money. So the, the whole idea is get more leads. More leads that you can nurture and work with equals more money at the end of the day. So how do you get these leads? How do you get these leads to come in basically on autopilot? Here's the image. So you can talk to somebody about leads and lead flow, and you can talk about are they doing Facebook ads, or are they doing cold calling, or are they doing newspaper advertising. Does anybody do that anymore? But you can talk to them different ways of leads coming in, and it gets all analytical. You can talk about the cost per lead, return on investment, um, you know, customer acquisition cost, and you get all analytical, and you go into the analytical part of the brain. And listen, some people, a very, very, very small percentage of people, that's exactly what they need to hear. But even those people first paint a picture. Paint a picture. And it can be something simple. It can be something simple. Okay, I'll give you an example. Have you ever seen a bear? You know, you see that big grizzly bear in the river. And they're, they're, at the, they're in the river, and the river is just raging, and the fish are jumping up, the salmon are jumping up, and the fish just opens his mouth, and the salmon just jump into his mouth. I'm like, what an easy job this, this bear is. You know, what, he could, he's strong. He's, he's got big bear claws. He could go destroy and eat and just tear people apart, tear other animals apart, and... But what does he do? He sits there, he opens his mouth, and the fish just jump in his mouth. Now, do you want to be the bear out there that's trying to find and hunt down and and, and, or, and, and find food every day? Or do you want to be the bear that opens your mouth and the salmon just jump right into your mouth? When you're full, you go back, take a bear nap. That's what you want to be. When people can have a mental image because they've seen this. They have either seen... The pictures or the videos of the bear sitting there and the fish just jumping. Or as you say it, they'll begin to imagine it. To either have already seen it or they'll begin to imagine it. And so what you're doing is you're painting a picture. 
So when you say, which would you rather be? They go, well, of course I'd rather be the bear with my mouth open catching the fishes that come in. Great. That's exactly what we offer you when you work with our program. Let me explain how it works. What you've done is one metaphorical picture, one story. They can see it. If they can see it, they can go, oh, I get it. It's kind of like, kind of like. I learned this from Russell Brunson, ClickFunnels. And um, I learned it years ago, actually, in some psychology and behavioral therapy training. But ClickFunnels, Russell, Russell Brunson really brought it out in, a, in a, a little better way. He was explaining ketones. Now, well, ketones and those who are in ketogenic diets, I'm not going to get into the science and the, all of that of ketones. Number one, I don't know it all. Number two, uh, it, is it really irrelevant here? But he was trying to explain ketones. And then what he said here was any time that you present information to someone and it's above their, uh, above their pay grade, they don't understand what's a ketone. I don't understand that. I understand what protein is, what a carbohydrate is. At least I kind of understand. But a ketone, they go like, what is a ketone? They shut down. But he's having to sell a ketone product. So he's got to talk about it in a way that they can relate to. So he says it like this. A ketone is like a million little motivational speakers running through your body, giving you energy. Now, his audience, they understand what a motivational speaker is. They know who, they've seen Tony Robbins. They know who the motivational speakers are. And that, so he says, like a million little motivational speakers. So you can have an image of a motivational speaker being real little, running through your body, giving you energy. Like, wow, that, that kind of makes sense. His key is it's kind of like. It's kind of like. And then he goes into what it is kind of like, <laughs> which is pretty good. Also, he talks about... Uh, taking the, there's several other analogies he uses, but you know, something that's kind of like, he says it's kind of like this. You know, if you ever played Pac-Man, and again, let's go back to his, his avatar. He's dealing with mostly people in their 30s, 40s, you know, some of they grew up, either grew up playing Pac-Man or they at least know what Pac-Man is. Pac-Man was this little teeny whatever, man, that was running, eating all these little pellets, and he was running from these ghosts. And that's usually how sometimes we feel in life. We're running, running, running. It's like life's chasing us down. But once in a while, Pac-Man would get a power pellet. Now, power pellet, all of a sudden, Pac-Man goes, do 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 that noise. I can't make it exactly. That was pretty good, pretty good uh, rendition of it. do 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 And all of a sudden, now the ghosts are blinking blue. They're terrified, and you've got power, and you chase down those ghosts, and you go, and you get the prize. And so it's, it's kind of like that. So a ketone kind of takes you from the one running to the one that's just got that power pellet. And all of a sudden, you're able to go, and you're able to take charge. You're able to clear the level. You're able to do what needs to be done in a day. So the power, So now a ketone, I had no clue in a scientific terminology, what a ketone does. But I know now I'm going to have a million little motivational speakers running through my body giving me energy, and I'm going to be able to out, out, outdo the competition. I'm going to have I'm out the power pellet. If I drink this or uh, consume this product, this is what I get. Now you've really painted a picture. So maybe you're weight loss coach, and maybe you're a uh, success coach, the dating coach, whatever it is, you're able to say to them, it's kind of like this. We paint a big picture. It's kind of like. So our lead generation system is kind of like the bear that sits in the river and opens his mouth and the fish just jump in. It makes a whole lot more sense than going out there and trying to chase down squirrels, rabbits, raccoons, whatever else. You just open your mouth and let the leads come in. It's kind of like what we do. Kind of like is a very powerful terminology. Again, it, it paints a picture, and from the picture, then you can chunk down and give specifics. But you want to get the image and the feeling that uh, it comes with that. Now, there's ways to elicit criteria and ways to elicit emotional states that will cause people to do business with you and cause people to transform their life. That we're not teaching on a podcast. That we're going to go into deep in our program. So if you haven't, signed up yet to become a coach with us, get the free book. Maybe you are a coach already. You're just listening to this podcast because you want to know how to go to six figures or beyond. So then you need to learn the skills of not just 
coaching, but the skills of marketing your coaching. So pick up the book. It's the first step. How to and so and you can do that at lifecoachlifestyle.com. Lifecoachlifestyle.com. You can also go to our Facebook group. Be sure to join the group. Jump on board with us. And that's how to sell coaching.com. How to sell coaching.com. If you're listening to this live or the day it's released, we're having a class tonight. Every Wednesday, 9 p.m. Every Wednesday, 9 p.m. Go to howtosellcoaching.com. This is Wayne Sutton. I believe in you. God bless. Thanks for joining us again at Prosper with Wayne. Be sure to subscribe to us for more exciting, life-changing episodes. Go today, in fact. Go now to prosperwithwayne.com and enter your email for our exclusive newsletter and other resources. God bless and go prosper.